Hello, hello, and welcome to another episode of Cyberpunk 2077. Let's see. Well, let's mm, do all this stuff. So open your inventory and put on some clothes. That is a good idea. Um, I have my jacket. Ooh, what's this? I want the spike sleeve jacket. Nah, no, not really. Uh, okay. And then... What is this? No, thank you. But I take that off. Unequip. There we go. And... You know what? You know what? You know what? Just for, just for the immersion, we'll do this how I, you know, normally would. Legs. Not really anything better. I'm not wearing hot pants. Uh, okay. And then... Shirt. Go with that. Then... Put on my shoes. Do I want to wear a hat? Ugh. Ugh. Put on my jacket. All right. Cool. Okay, stuck up on ammo. It's over here, right? Find something to eat. Check my email. Oh boy. You'll get your money. Takemura here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Okay. Make a building H10 run. That your vehicle is available for collection. Nearby parking garage. Wish you a pleasant day. First will come the great reality check. Treasures in the future of the new world. Just hand yourself. Uh, okay. Okay. seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Just trouble. Usual stuff. Got any guns I can uh, buy? Uh, in need of iron and lead then, I take it? Sure. Let me see what you got. Let's see. Power, power, power. Power, tech, power, 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 power. Nothing but power. I don't need power. Okay, well, let's sell some of my stuff. That, that, that. Uh, no, that is. And then, 
I think I'll dismantle the greens aside from, aside from the iconics. The iconics I will keep. Well. That's equipped. Okay, and now I want to buy, can I buy components? No? Okay. Okay. Let's see. I want to get more cyberware. Uh, it's going to be easier to fast travel to where I need to be. Come to think of it. Uh, let's see. Hmm. I can't get anything from Vic. But I need a Fix over here. Ooh, let's take a look over here. Fuck. All right. No. Ba, 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 ba. There we are. Let's see if this guy's got anything for me. Up, up, uh. Okay, let me read these. Allows you to perform quick hacks on enemies and devices while scanning. Enemies take 40% longer to trace your location. What is this? Okay. 40% um, longer. Trace your location. Tier 1. Extract data. Distract enemies. Remote deactivation. Camera control. Initiate overload. Remote... Two friendly moves. Currents. Um, don't want that. Don't want that. Allows you to perform uh, quick hacks on enemies and devices while scanning. 50%. Weapon damage against enemies affected by non combat quick hacks. As opposed to, I kind of like. Hmm. Okay, what do you got? 15% duration for combat quick hacks. That could be good for the burning. Um, and 10% uh, quick hack damage. I kind of like... Mm, I kind of like the idea of you know, them taking longer to find me, which would give me more opportunities to use quick hacks while stealth. So I'm going to go with this. Yeah. Firm. Cool. All right. What about here? Well, let's look and see if we can put on anything with extra armor. Um, mitigation chance. When, uh, no. Current gents reduce incoming damage. Um, plus fifty percent armor, minus twenty percent movement speed. Uh, plus one forty. Melee damage. There's got to be something. Receiving damage restores RAM. Equal to 0.22% of damage received, plus one max RAM. That might be what I want for this build. So, 
Yeah, let's go with that. All right. It's ricochet damage. Smart link. Plus one max ram. Oh, that's the same. Hmm. Hmm. Crit chance with blades. Slows time. Slows time. Mm, no. No. Let's see what we got here. 10% movement speed when your health drops to 25%. Mm, melee attack speed. Functions as a powerful health item. Um, adrenaline booster plus three, melee. Okay, wait a minute. Plus one, plus point one ram regen when neutralizing an enemy. Hmm. Uh, automatically heals you when you're. That might be good. Four percent health when you. Hmm. Mm. What about over in here? That might be worth it. Uh, the closer... I mean... Uh, yeah, okay. And then over here... Uh, it'd be plus five. Hmm... Okay, what about legs? Quieter movement, six plus one point six percent quick hack damage. Let's do okay. We're gonna go with that. All right. Is there anything? Yeah, let's sell the junk. Yeah, a little bit of extra cash. Um. A chain sword. There are chain swords in this game now? Well, let's uh, sell that. Sell that. I'll keep the iconic stuff. Oh my goodness, I have so much shit. Um, I could probably sell all but one thing. Can't sell that. Okay. And then up. I don't know why I have so many. Maybe it's a bug for having like five playthroughs or something. I don't know. Okay, and I think I can actually get more cyberware now. Or not? Well, yeah, I wouldn't use these anyway. Um what about here? Okay, so highlights cameras and turrets within 20 meters. Um, effect remains. Uh, minus 25% camera. Highlights explosive devices. Highlights enemies behind cover. Probably want this, maybe. Well, let me look at the other things. So what's this? Titanium bones, plus 38% carrying capacity. Uh, let's see. Melee damage, armor. Hmm. Yeah, I probably would want this, but I want to look at other things real quick. I mean... Slows time down. Uh, let's see, is there anything that gives me more quick hack stuff? No? Okay, what about over here? I think I might want to save.
Melee damage. Yes. And then, okay. Okay. What? I didn't wake up in the thing. Like I did the last time. Okay, well, I should be good. Let's let's test some of this shit out. Map. Go over there. You know, it's weird that, you know, they put in this whole, like, revamped cop system. But I remember one of the complaints for this game being that it was, quote-unquote, copaganda. How do I... Oh, my contacts are there. Okay. Elamine... Where are you? Mama Wells. B. Good to hear you. Finally. Been a long time since we talk. Since when Jackie passed away. How are you doing? How do you think? My son is dead. Yeesh. But I am hanging in there. Call in to offer my condolences. Offer your condolences. Ay, eso Cristo vi. You lived under our roof. Have the decency not to treat me like some stranger you just met. I was going to call you. I prepared an ofrenda for Jaquito. We can't let him go without a proper goodbye. The ceremony will be at the Coyote Cojo. Many of his friends will be there. Say no more, Mama Wells. I'll be there. I did not doubt it for a second. Ahí te veo, Vi. Bruce finished him off too quick. Better stretch it out over two more rounds. Oh shit, I gotta install quick hacks. Oh, that could have been bad. Uh, what does it require? What, um, level? Or int? Character. Not quite sure. Huh. Well. Okay. Well, I can just put everything in there, can't I? I don't know what that symbol is. Required. It looks like a person, so I'm going to assume it's level. Maybe it's streak red. I hope it's level. Okay. Hold on. Wait a minute. Sidewinder. Isn't that a... That is a... Assault rifle. More damage. Let's reload speed. Higher effective range. Okay.
Well, let's start with a ping. So we can mark people. Overheat. One of those, and they'll find me probably. And you don't need to see me. Uh, who needs to aim? Am I right? Overheat, overheat, there you go. I just get a quick hack off that lady? I think I did. Ah! Oh god. Oh, hoo hoo. Hi. I just need all their stuff. It's important. Boop, boop. Can't I craft better components? Yeah. Okay, now. What's quick hack components? So I guess that's different. Power assault. Smart double barrel shotgun. Um. Okay. I'm curious. Put that in here. Where are you? Double barrel shotgun. Uh. B -b -b Bah. I leveled up. Wait a minute. I did not. How did I get that? Oh, I got an extra perk point from Netrunner. Okay. Hmm. Uh, 
warning explosion hazard plus 40% explosion damage from hacked devices. Uh, no. Force skill siphon. Reduce sequence length required to hack access points by one. Not really that hard. Data recycler. After neutralizing an enemy, recover 80% of the RAM cost from all quick hacks remaining in their queue. Uh, counter a hack. When you're the target of an enemy netrunner, you can quick hack them back through walls and obstacles. Um, feedback loop. Plus 25% RAM recovery rate for each quick hack. Currently in a queue. Okay. Uh, minus one RAM cost for the first quick hack of each unique category that is second or later in the queue. I don't know what. Uh, queue prioritization. Plus 50% upload speed for the first quick hack when you have at least two quick hacks queued on an enemy. Mono wire finisher. What's this? When overclock is active, plus 40 health for each quick hack uh, queued. So, how much RAM do I have? It, it should be here, right? Or I can just look. I can just look. Ah, uh, ba ba ba. I have no idea how much RAM I have in total. It's like that's six plus like one or two. Mm. Hmm. Well. Um. If you have a cyber stack, cyber deck and yeah, oh, you have to have three points in there to get it to work. Huh. That's interesting. Siphon monowire attacks recover 0 0.5 RAM, increases to one if the enemy is afflicted or targeted by a quick hack. So this definitely pushes you to get a monowire. Um, can I afford one? I don't think that place had a monowire. If it did, I didn't have enough money for it. I think it would be at a ripper dock. But. Anyway. Let's do another one of these. Things for money. I don't have my car. I'm probably going to have to go take care of that. Message. Fire claws. Head for the building. Back in your home locker. Heat, short circuit. Come on out, you know. 
just gotta wait. One more. Okay. Overheat. Oop. I'll just come in and get my stuff. Thank you, sir. What the fuck is that? Machete. A machete. Actually, maybe we can get some quick hack components. Extra quick hacks. So I can do BD one C E nine. BD one C E nine. One C E nine. One C E nine. One C E nine. Cool. Okay. Anything else I can steal? Nope. Go to given coordinates. Oh shit, you can just... No, okay. I need to get my car. I really need to get my car. I don't see a... I'm looking around for a... a fast travel terminal. But I don't see it. I see cops. Watch, I'm gonna be like... five feet away. Oh, there... Uh, yeah, no, that works. That works, that works, that works. Cross. Thank you for slowing down. I appreciate it. Can you go in the water? Yes, you can. Down with C. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Uh, got a new one of these. Well, doesn't I look like fucking Peg? From married with children. No. No, no, no. I don't understand why there's like an arrow next to it. Because I thought they took care of, you know. Well, in the meantime...
Okay. Where is the nearest? Right there. Okay, I will continue with the story. But honestly, I... Mm. So I'm kind of torn. That That is honestly the way I like to play uh, this game. It's why I have like hundreds of hours into it. I like going, you know, and doing everything. And uh, I'm going to get hit. No, I'm not. Huzzah! And like... Um, picking stuff up and you know, doing what I just did for the past half hour. But I don't know how interesting that is. I mean, <laughs> I am not sure that I am that interesting to begin with. Although they say you shouldn't put yourself down. Try not to put myself down. Um, I don't even know why I'm recording this. No one watches this. This is just like a journal, so it's for me. So I guess I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. Hey, yo! We return to this week's biggest story. The murder of Arasaka Corporation CEO, Saburo uh, Arasaka. The ground floor, I think? The longtime head of the Japanese mega corporation was reported slain on the premises of the Konpeki Plaza Corporate Hotel while attending a family gathering. Saburo Arasaka's son, Yarinobu Arasaka, has cast blame for his father's murder on the company's rivals, although he has not yet provided no, evidence this claim. According to market analysts... Okay, uh, let's see what you got, Takamura. Ugh. I'm fine. This is fine. Hold on. One sec. Okay. Sit. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why'd you help me? Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorinobu Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Um, yeah. She answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Hmm. Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma, to be sure, but she showed that slyness you get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I do possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? <sighs> Sorry, I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose. B, so. wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice? In Night City? I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. 
I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what, we stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. Hanako-sama, oai tekete koe des. Kochira koso. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you. Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind, that's all. He reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. The last thing we want to do is draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. I do like that your origin kind of changes or flavors the uh thanks for the offer dialogue options think about it get back to you i need time to plan organize you stand to gain much if you help me all i ask is that you do not leave the city leave why would i leave need help best chance i'll find the right person here Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. You're an Obu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about a plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... 
What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Hmm, somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found, things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. She take you for a suit? No, she saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you've got some nerve. First you're out to kill me, now you want to be my pal and make like nothing happened? You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You are the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you've had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What would I say to her? I got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories. Gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Not for now. Okay. V? That you? Shit. I thought you were gone. You're not alone in thinking me dead. Thought it was game over for me, too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. Heard about the heist, I take it. Must have talked to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Whole damn city's hurt. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. Know where she is? what I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I won't? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Okay, well, uh, journal. We got a, we got a lot of, a lot of fucking.
fucking quests. Okay, so... Um, need to collect this reward. But actually, no. I need to get... I need to get... Uh, God. Finding my way to stuff is kind of... Ah, anyway. Um, let's see. Uh, b -b 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 fetch your vehicle. Um, is there a thing closer? So that's mega building. No, I think I'll just... I think I'll just walk look both ways. This is this is a game that makes me want to get a 4080 or a 4090 even though I'm like, you know, super poor and can't afford one. Um I don't even think I have my system could power one. Uh but I would like to see this in like the ultra, you know. Um ray tracing mode thingy. Feels off here. You don't say. <laughs> Rack I mean the run. City's most courteous chauffeur up and drives away from the scene of an accident. Well, ha what okay. Please accept our sincerest apologies regarding traffic incident number yada yada yada. The Delamain Corporation cordially invites you to its main headquarters in order to assess damages and arrange compensation. Oh boy. So. Yeah, let's go to Arasaka Tower. For a fast travel point. Fast travel point. Where are you? Where are you, fast travel point? We're over here. We're not. You're up there. I can't get to you. With me. Hey, look. Look what? What? I, that wasn't what I meant to do. Whoops. Whoops. But I can get up here.
There's a fast travel point. Hey, watch it. You ask me, your words. Hey, you there? Yes, I'm you talking know, to you. But you were Are you getting what you want out of life? Deal with downtown, city center. V. Yeah, I know. Heard about you. Hot stuff. Need anything, you call me. Remember, Dino knows everybody. And by the way, you're welcome to swing by anytime. Club's always open to you if you need a stiff drink. Electric orgasm can't miss it. Okay. Uh. Uh. There we go. Not having to worry about stamina while running is excellent. Like, absolutely excellent. Wonderful change. I'm glad they made it. Ear to the ground. Siempre. Anyway, you need something. You know where to find me. All right. My lawyer's gonna go data crash on your ass. You hear me? He'll run you out of biz. Would you be so kind as to give me your lawyer's contact information? Fuck you, Sirk Brain! Thank you. Processing data now. Please wait. Uh, hey, doll. Hello, sir or madam. How can I be of hey, service? Hey, What's gotten into you, Del? Don't recognize me? You sent me a message saying I should come in about the accident. You are currently speaking to a Delamay network subroutine. Alas, my operational capabilities are limited. Could you please clearly recite your incident report? Don't give him any numbers. That's um, how they find you. 77 11 0 1 0 96. Incident report on file. Confirmed. 96 at the end. It's a public enemy. Government target. Your identity has been established. Mrs. Elaine Pagels, what phrase would best describe your experience? <laughs> I don't think my name is Elaine Pagels. Prima accident, I shit green apples. Now get me the real Delamain. V, my apologies if the receptionist was a bother. I'm preoccupied with the crisis that is on Interesting. Jersey, and I simply cannot oversee everything. I've taken the liberty of transferring a settlement to your account to compensate for the damage done. Ah, special treatment. Would you mind if we spoke elsewhere? Sure, let's talk. Then please, follow the drone. Okay, drone. Take me to your leader. I'm fully aware customer service is less than satisfactory at the moment. Perhaps a guided tour will prove some form of compensation. This corridor links the shop to the office. Okay. And here is where the magic happens. The shop is fully automated. I'm pondering broadening my portfolio to include repair services. Where'd it go? Alas, the shop is currently overwhelmed with work. I think I know why. I'm still looking into the cause of the Delphi network being failures. My working hypothesis is an advanced virus. I must resolve the situation quickly. 
this sudden rise in incidents is proving costly, aside from drawing unwanted attention to the company. I do like this quest quite a bit. I think it's very good, very well written. The control room. I feel honored to have you here. Rather, surprisingly. Control rooms are for Ganex. What good is it to you? There was a time this facility was human operated. I simply inherited their infrastructure. All these lights, what are they for? That's what I wish to discuss with you. A green light denotes a vehicle with which I am in contact. As you can see, that is no longer the case for some vehicles. Those are the red lights. Repair drones can't take care of this? This time, I fear, human intervention is required. I'm aware you offer a broad range of services and are unusually discreet. Thus, I'd like you to assist me in recovering my missing vehicles. Why is discretion a concern? Unnoticed, unbothered, right? In my case, broadly tolerated. Yet a marked increase in inspections suggests the authorities have begun monitoring me. Talking in CPD or Netwatch? The latter. My legal status does not fit neatly within current regulations. If I'm not careful, I could easily be categorized as an illegal immigrant. Okay, sure. I'll go after your missing wheels. I'm pleased to hear it. I shall send you the coordinates of their last known locations. You must simply deactivate each. I'll then re-establish the link and return them to my garage. See what I can do. Delamain vehicles are exceptionally secure. Be sure to have a scanner with decryption capability on your person. Okay. Leave the garage. Oh, frame rate drop. Major frame rate drop. Oh, that's better. Okay. Well, we're not doing that right now because I need a friggin' car to do it. <sighs> okay, so... Uh, yeah, no, we got to do that one next. Ba -ba -ba. Hold on. Is there, uh, there is. So, there's one right next to me. Let's make this trip quick and easy. better to tell you the truth what is happening that night when when jackie fell let's just say things haven't exactly been easy since yo sé cómo te sientes todos lo sabemos i am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda there is still so much to take care of 
could help you with that. Gracias, mi cielo. But I will manage. It's enough you come to say goodbye. I want to take part in the ceremony, but... I want to do it the right way. In line with tradition. Mm-hmm. But... Something I'd, I'd lay by his casket that'd do justice to his memory, I... I don't got anything. But your heart... It's in the right place, mi niña. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. Ahí te veo. Man, <laughs> if, I don't know, if only it were that easy to be that articulate. Well, for some people it is. Not for me. Yeah, let's see what we got in here. Oh, hi. Hi, V. I forgot about you. You here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was going to happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. That's not how I see it. I see it as like you have a percentage chance of a thing happening. And over time, the percentage gets higher and higher. So I think you'd be in more danger now than then. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Boy, I know that feeling. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes two. I know it's gonk. It's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just... Well, human. I guess. You know each other long? Half our lives. Grew up in the same streets. Saw each other a lot, but just never got together. Till a year back. Yeah. Best darn year of my life. Jack talked about you. A lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. <laughs> Maybe, but that's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. Nah, Jack was... Jack was a little of that, too. Always looking on the bright side. He wore his heart on his sleeve. And wasn't at all afraid to live fully. Had his inner demons, though. Who doesn't? Exactly. They're what makes us who we really are on the inside. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. How come you're outside? I don't have the key. Jackie never gave you a set? You two didn't get that far. He offered, but I wanted him to have his own space. Just his own. Mama Wells is having a send off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. Mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon. No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things, disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie'd want you here. That's more important. Come on.
in and search the garage. Love to poke around engines. He was 15 when he first got on a bike. Knowing him, it is a miracle he never wiped out. Probably did. Guess no man cave's complete without some of those, huh? He said they're collectibles. They don't print them anymore. Uh huh. It's definitely why they're up there, yeah. For whom the bell tolls, Ernest Hemingway. Jack read it a dozen times, always right before a big job. He said the guy who wrote it was tougher than Morgan Blackhand. You read it? Is it any good? I... I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for the Ofrenda, though. Hmm. No. Is there anything else in here? <laughs> Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. <laughs> Gotta be hanging here since 2020. Oh, Jackie. That a, a mandala? Mm hmm. Oof. It's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home. The Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's beautiful. It's hideous. <laughs> but it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Jackie's favorite tequila. Still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. The founder of Sensan Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. How did Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him de Abajo had stolen her recipe. And is there anything else to that story? It's not. Gotta be Jackie's dad. Old school ganger. Valentino's, of course. Did you meet him? No, I only ever heard about him. But he didn't exactly inspire many fond memories. Ooh, okay, so BD55, five five. BD55, five five. Five five. BD55, five five, five five. E9, five five, BD. Wait a minute. What? Well, whatever. <sighs> A little bit of extra cash. Let's see. Or just right, Jackie, my man. You won't believe your luck. Collector selling beauty in premium condition. Price is good. If a little over your budget, let me know if you're interested. Because if you aren't, I'll go someplace else. Peace. Uh, ba ba ba.
Okay. In an aquarium? They used to be tacos. And taco was... Miss Fish. A dwarf shark. Like, mini. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. All right. Basketball signed by Dante Gonzalez. He was from Haywood, too. Everyone here shot hoops. Dante ran circles around him. I think he might have been the first kid to ditch the Valentinos. Like Jackie? Mm-hmm. They both wanted more out of life. Dante's captain of the NC Blackouts now. Hmm. Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. How come? ¿Por qué no puedes tocar una reserva estratégica, va? So... Yeah. So I'm thinking the ball. Because, like, this is something he read before a job. Right? So he probably read that before he was killed. Um... But the ball kind of represents, like, the fact that he wanted to, wanted a better life. So, this one is hope. This one is doom. So, I'm going to go with hope. Which is this. Maybe I'm putting Fitting. too much thought into it, but that's well, the thought I'm putting got in. something for your refrenda, but we could look around a little more. Is there anything else to look around? Oh. Nice still. Okay. Where are you going? Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. You gotta come, Misty. Got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So, shall we go? You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? Meaning... Packed my bags and hopped on a plane to Nepal. Thought I'd stay there. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. Yeah, that's a much better dodge system. The boop, boop, boop. Double tap. Go raise a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. Vi, sí. it's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Hey, Vi. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. 
He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying. Make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true. Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, 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 honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh, I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. It all started when he put a heater to my head. Then some badges showed up. Beat the shit out of both of us. Half my fault, half his. We hightailed it out together. Half an hour later, we were eating dinner at Mama Wells's. Turned out to have more in common than we thought. Principles. Jackie Wells. Always hungry for more and never gave up. Not once. Once he set his mind on something. He was ready to die to achieve it. He... He once told me, Chica, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. For his loved ones, he'd sacrifice his life without hesitation. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear. Heart on his sleeve, he, he didn't overthink things, he just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof. And that he'd become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. If he's watching, I bet just about now he's flipping them all the bird. A Haywood kid with a hell of a drive. Rest easy, Chum. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, B. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful offering that we gave him. Okay. Let's go talk to the bartender. Pour you another for Jaquito. See, the Valentinos haven't forgotten about Jackie. Days like this, even the meanest motherfuckers pay their respects. Principles. Jackie lived by them. They's what kept him going. Poor. 
for Jackie. Amen, sister. Uh, Campos all torn up. Says he feels like he lost one of his own. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after you die. Oh, chingado. Don't go starting something, eh? Not today. Look to Vicar. Victor. I'm gonna miss him. I already do. <laughs> Me too, chica. <sighs> Me too. Here's to Jackie. Got off to greener pastures. Why is that texture so bad? Jackie Wells. A proud son of Haywood. <sighs> I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. A lot of people come today. Even that Budica Jackie was messing around with. All right, so we shouldn't talk business. It'll be rude. Here to say goodbye to one of your own, Padre. I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. So... Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us from up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it? I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. Jackie, did you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. All right. Um, talk to the Valentinos. Hey, you! Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? All right. Sure. Why not? To Wells. May he rest in peace. How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible book club. <laughs> yeah. I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. Good for now. Thanks. See? You gotta know when to stop. Nah, right, give me a break. All right, let's go. All right, gotta talk to Mama Wells, smooth things over with her, and, uh... Her name is Misty. What? Misty. She was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. Do you know what? You're a good woman. Jackie would want you to have these. <laughs> you sure? Jackie'd kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuidate, be. Fast forward. Me smashing into everything. Lupe's been handling the loss pretty good. Ah. She's a strong man. All right, we finally got a freaking vehicle. Where is it? There it is. I didn't give him the advice to fix it. It sounds different. I think I needed um, more, more in, in, what was it? 
uh, more in technical ability to give him good advice. Hey, hey, see, 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 I knew that would happen. Okay. Uh, there's gotta be a ripper dock around here somewhere in the direction that I am going. Yes. Okay. We'll go to that one. I really want the uh, Akira bike or the approximate, you know, copyright, uh, the, the indistinct Akira bike. Or a supercar. Yes, I did. And I would appreciate a lot of fucking money. Oh, uh, shit. I turned too soon. Got for me, sir. Or ma'am. Ma'am. Looking to upgrade my chrome. Okay. You sit, be comfy, and we will start. Okay. So. Huh. Okay. Manus blades, manus blades, manus blades. Grill arms. Grill arms, grill arms, grill arms. Projectile, launch system, launch system, launch system. Monowire, there we go. We want 16,000 and more cyberware capacity. That's what this is, cyberware capacity. Okay, well... Um, highlights enemies behind cover, minus 25%. Highlights camera and turrets, highlights explosive devices. I kind of want, well, actually, no. No, no. Recoup. Uh, titanium bones. That's more armor. What's this? Micro generator. Brilliant really to cause the next shot to release an electroshock. Deals up to 90 electrical damage. Interesting. Huh.
Increases movement, slows time, more movement. Mm. It'd be plus five armor. Um, In air to perform a double jump allows you to do tar charge jumps. I kind of like the idea of double jumping. So, uh, yeah. And then let's see. I want to see what happens when I upgrade some of this stuff. Upgrade. So, more armor. I want to see if I can, if there's anything that will. Let's do health. I don't need that. Um, can't get anything there. What happens when you upgrade this? Oh, I don't have enough. I don't have enough stuff. Uh, uh. Yeah, that gives me more armor. What about this? I don't see a difference. So that would be a waste. So we're going to get this to get the RAM regen. And what does this do? Wait, what? Okay. Oh, two max RAM. That might be worth Yeah, no. Let, yeah, let's do that. Okay. I like this system. What happens if you upgrade? So plus three armor. And if you upgrade plus five. Hmm. Well, let me sell some of my stuff. I don't want that. I don't want that. Uh else yeah let's get rid of this this and this and let's see clothing wise is there anything i want to get rid of no macaques synapse burnout i got two of them i don't really need two so uh, I could probably um, dismantle that. So, how about no? Soldering iron. Junk. Yeah, let's get rid of. Sell the junk. Whopping six eddies. Let's go. Okay. So. Uh, six times opticals. Where's the highlights? Camera and turrets minus twenty percent speed plus one point six percent quick hack damage. Uh, I'm gonna go with this, and it's only minus twenty two percent. So no, thank you. Um. Let's see here. I'm not ha I thought I had money. Okay. Um. Plus two percent. What happens if I upgrade this? 
So I'll get an extra three armor and a 0.1% crit chance per attribute point. Don't really want that. Mm. I can't upgrade that to tier two. Uh, let's see. It looks like this is probably the best thing to uh, upgrade. Okay. Can't upgrade that. And I don't have enough cyberware capacity. Mm. Melee damage minus eight percent. Yeah, let's pick up that. Can I upgrade that? Well, I mean, I can, but I'd have to go into my inventory and dismantle some things. See, I like that. I like that. I like that quite a bit. Hmm. Let's go to my weapons that's equipped that's not so hold on I want to keep the iconic stuff I want to disassemble this it isn't connected to anything that's not connected to anything All right. Uh, okay, so I should have enough to upgrade both of these. Yeah. And then... All right, more, more armor. Get your resistance to damage. You can increase your armor by investing in skeleton and okie doke, okie smoke. It's gonna be a while before I can have a mono wire, so we're not even gonna think about it when it comes to leveling. Um, where, where, oh, where is my character? Okie dokie. So I think, what's this? Rent to an additional target. I like that. Active. Smart weapons gain instant target lock plus 25% damage. So this is a really important part of my kit. So, does this mean I can queue three things? Okay. Uh, need to go see Wokako. Afterlife. The gig. All right. I need money. Got you so amused. Oh, 
Alright. Got something that'll keep you wet for hours. You looking for some company tonight? No, thank you. I'm good. Well, well. Who do I spy but V? In my humble parlor, no less. Okako, long time no see. So what brings you here? Um... Have some outstanding biz to settle. Remember Sandra Dorset? I don't forget such things, V. Here is your reward. It comes with a fairly ample bonus. Go see a Ripper Doc. They'll weave you a dermo imprint that will enable smart gun compatibility. A tiger claw specialty. Okay, thank you. Once again, I must decline your offer. Kind though it is. I'm just upset that if I spent money and resources on a smart gun thingy that I didn't have to. Well, I kind of had to. Um... I can do three in a row. Uh. Uh, no, I want to try the shotgun. Come here. Oh, that's ridiculous. Alright. Let's take all of your shit. Huh. Cargo pants. A hey, level up. One more in it, please. And more quick hack damage. And then There's more stuff. I gotta get all the stuff. Now this game was already like good. Like I, I I'm I'm one of the people who liked it. And I feel like it's just gotten so much better. I mean problems like falling through the world notwithstanding, which still happens sometimes, but it's like, eh. B, can you talk? It is important. What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. That's gonna help us how, exactly. There will be a meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at the Coppic Plaza. I have little hope that he will be convinced. But it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability. Even that of old friends. Sure about this guy? Trust him. Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one. Yes, I trust him. Fine. Where's the meat and when? 
in Japan town. After sunset, I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. I gotta go fo go find Evelyn first. I mean, once I get this. You want to go? Let's try the vehicle combat. Uh, this is the fucking end. We pressed alt. That's not the weapon I want. Uh, alt. Alt. Uh, this one, please. Uh, hold on. Draw weapon. Cycle weapon. Fuck it. I'm just gonna kill him. Okay. Now I can get on. Uh, why? Why are you pulling out the absolute worst weapon you could pull out? I like smart shotguns. Just every pe like imagine if you had that in Destiny. That'd be fantastic. Um, let's see. Mm. All that in there. Okay. Mm. This symbol, this symbol. Hi. How you fellas doing? Boop. 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 Just gotta get my ram back. Coming to get you, you little shit. Well, let's take care of that. Hey, you fellas. I have a shotgun. Okay, so how do I... Make it around. Let's reload. And... 
Put it away. Oh, hi. Let's overheat you. Overheat you. And reboot your optics. We're not all bad, you know. Let's talk. Mercy. Oh. I did to do <laughs> That's how we do it. What now? Um. that shit. Let's see what's good. Take your pick. Enables the use of smart targeting weapons. I mean... It saves you a bit of space. Mm. Two less RAM though. Minus quick hack damage. So no, I will not. What about... For here... Uh, yeah, sure. Maybe if I upgrade it, I'll get a little bit of extra RAM. Nope. Just, yeah, no. Alright. Uh, oh, I really don't have enough of those things. Yeah, sure. Then can I upgrade this? What do I get for it? Then 22 meters instead of 20. Uh, not worth it. All right. Well. That is going to be it for this episode of Cyberpunk 2077. Thank you uh, so much for joining me, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.